in northern Saskatchewan, Canada, Cameco is operating the world's largest high-grade uranium mine. Employee safety is always the company's top priority. We're located about uh, 600 kilometers north of Saskatoon, Saskatchewan. Saskatoon is a hub centre for, uh, for Cameco and its northern operations. On site we have uh, approximately uh, 430 employees. All of our operation is supported through a fly-in, fly-out operation. Uh, materials, equipment is, is brought in through, uh, through truck, but all personnel essentially travel uh, to site via airplane. Operating a uranium mine at MacArthur River demands specific safety, health and environment considerations, all of which are designed to keep the operation as safe and efficient as possible. Well, I've been uh, working at MacArthur River for about four and a half years now. Uh, even in that short amount of time, uh, lots has changed. The mine expands drastically every day. It's always changing. Uh, even the safety factors uh, change quite a bit throughout the mine. We're a lot more uh, diligent on your proper PPE. This is the OSLD badge, which measures uh, gamma radiation. So everyone that works here um, as a nuclear energy worker has to wear one of these. And what this does is measure your radiation um, on a quarterly basis. And uh, at the end of that, the radiation department replaces this with a new one. So they'll send this one away to be analyzed and that will tell um, the radiation department what I've been exposed to um, from a gamma source. And the letter sent to right to my home tells me that so my wife can see it, my kids can see it, um, showing that uh, it's been a safe place to work. Cameco partner Sandvik Mining contributes to the company's safety standards by supplying equipment like the specially designed Sandvik 6200W drill. The drill itself has a lot more safety features. We're always adding new things. We have uh, a pipe ramp that is able to manipulate the pipe on and off of the drill and that keeps our helpers away from the rotating parts, which is huge. That's uh, one of our main dangers with this. And it also helps uh, with the lifting of the rods as well. The, the steel we use is fairly heavy, so there's no more uh, manpower needed. 